Okay, so we're going to look at the 12 different points on the um, DVSA special test form. Um, so we've got the, <clears throat> there's 12 different points. Some are high, higher weighted than others, so we need to be aware of that. Um, we've got, the first one is knowledge and effective use of controls. At this level, they want to make sure that you can control the car, you know where all the controls are, and you're using those controls properly. Um, so they want you to use as a, um, effectively, so if it was raining, putting the, the windscreen wiper on, that sort of thing. And the second one's moving off and stop procedures. So are we moving off and stopping safely? Are we fully aware of what's happening on the road? We need to be doing this to a high standard if we're going to be teaching other people to drive. Um, effective use of mirrors. So a good driver knows what's happening around him as, as much as what's hap much as happening behind, as much as what's happening in front. So we need to be using those mirrors effectively. Um, correct and effective use of signals. So they don't want you to do unnecessary signals. So if you're coming up to a junction, you're signalling left or whatever, and you don't need to do that, um, there's no one going to actually benefit from that signal. They will mark you down at this level because the idea is you come up to a junction, um, is it safe for you to go? Um, is, is Are you going to let people know? So if, you, if you're coming up to a junction and there's no one to actually benefit from the fact that you're going to go left, so the fact that we're seeing them going to go left, then you need to be aware of that. So um, the idea is that you, when you come to a junction, you're aware of everything around you. The storm to benefit from that signal. Don't put the signal on, and it shows that you're you're fully aware of what's happening, rather than going to autopilot and put the signal on. Um, so um, response to traffic signal signs and road markings. So we need to be aware of um, things like the um, things like traffic lights, um, signs, that sort of thing, and, and actually be able to act really well in advance when we see them. Um, road positioning, normal driving and lane discipline. So um, we need to be taking a correct road position all the time. Um, in normal driving, um, we need to be keeping our, our, our correct position on the road, so not too far out, not too far in. Um, the, the lane discipline is important, so we're going to be swerving out into different lanes. Negotiating bends so on the left-hand lane would stay in our normal road position in the middle of the, the lane as we go around. On our, our right then we we'll go to the far left so we get a better view of what's happening. So um, we need to, that's really important that we have those. Um, and also when we negotiate in bends just to brake before the bend and drive into it. You don't want to brake on the bend because all the pressure will be in the outside front wheel so you could lose traction. So brake before it and drive into it so the, the pressure's on the two front wheels as you go around. Um, Negotiating junctions and slip roads, so they want to make sure you're getting up to speed. Um, so, <coughs> and that you're um, you're, you're get really getting up to speed on this, so that you're not um, not holding the traffic back, but you're getting up to speed. And um, awareness, anticipation, and planning skills. They want to make sure you've got, you know exactly what's happening ahead. You're planning it. You're 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 getting your your driving in sync with the other road users. And um, obviously the manoeuvring exercises. If you're teaching people different manoeuvres, you need to be first class on this. So um, they will, you know, it's observation, control, accuracy. Are you observing around? Are you are you, un are you keeping the car under control? And are you accurate where you're actually putting the car as you reverse it? So these things are, are really important. So um, they will mark you on that. They need to make sure that you really are. Um, if you're going to teach people to drive, you need to be able to, to do these things at a very high standard and under pressure from. A, a top examiner at the DVSA.